You know what the best part of the day is? This right here. Ah. That's it. That's that money. This is going to be another port 16 inches down. And it's for where the two garage doors are. So when the cars come in, there'll be that much more concrete reinforced. It's going to be a badass garage. All right, guys. That's it for now. We'll see you when we're stripping forms. We also put these pads in. Seven of them. New Dura coming soon, baby. I'll be so ready. I'll be so ready to work with this Nadera instead of this uh, old 10 year old concrete uh, wooden forms. Gonna hop in the truck, go work on some waterline for the day. But our walls ended up turning out to be money like we knew they would. We did these for the uh, extra slab for the, where the car garage doors are. Not enough vibration right there, but. Uh, besides that one spot, not a lot of honeycomb anywhere else, so be a uh, door into the foundation. The southwest wall looks pretty good though. All anchor walls look good. Fire. Killing that timesheet. Just clocked out. All under dirt is where it needs to be. Got our brick ledge. Our wall looks straighter than it looks, I promise put up that garage faster 42 yards of concrete on its way it's a 28 foot wide marked 14 which was the middle two feet two inches on each side that's where the beams will sit for the house boss really knows what he's doing got the best mentor in the game and uh, we got our hands full tomorrow but we're gonna go ahead and sew this thing up Show you guys what blue collar dollars look like. Thanks for watching. God bless. Got a, got a window drain. Got to connect that still. She's ready though. We put a 90 on it. Goes got flow all the way from the drain outside. Pops back into the sump which is on the inside of the house. You can't see the sump, it's there in the corner. What you got to say? It's gear done. Essentials. We're all done here, man. We're wrapping it up. Love this site. Some more backfill in a little bit. Thanks for watching.